You are not the only one who just got this problem called SE host point .exe system warning and now hardware hard ear. Anyways, this problem has been got by me and I just found three ways to fix that problem. Just follow me in this video and you will find out. So before we start this video, hello my name is Dino and I am the computer enthusiastic. I make videos about the computers uh, to fix problems and sometimes some, some tech news. And if you just want to learn more about my videos and uh, my channel, just click that subscribe button and don't forget the uh, notification bell so you don't miss any videos in the future. So let's get into our problem. So the first way to fix this problem is to just go to the system configuration so all you have to do is to just go to this windows tape here and type system configuration and here is it just click on it and uh, there will be something appearing here and just click yes and just wait it for a while now just go to the services here and make sure you ju just have this this one selected now go to the service now just go here and check this box uh, saying hide all microsoft services and now disable all and now just click apply and then ok now he will tell you that you will have to just restart your computer to make changes i recommend this because this will uh, help you just uh, refresh your computer and fix the problem for now we are not going to do that because we are going to show you the next method to fix that problem so we click exit without a stop now the second thing here it should be about the common prompt so we just go again here and type in comment prompt it's just easy like that and make sure you run it as administrator so like that and click yes and here is it so we just type in this one chkdsk and then backslash and f and backslash r and just press enter and it should be starting to do the process and there will be a message here saying would you like to schedule this volume to be checked the next time the system restarts so you will have to just put in yes but currently i don't want to do this uh, this is just what i i suggest you to use it so yeah this was the second one now let's go to the last one so we just go again to command prompt and make sure it it's running in administrator and now just type in sfc scan now and yeah sfc backslash and then scan now and just press enter and it's also gonna start the process and it will take some time and it may just restart your computer for now i just want to tell you thank you for watching and i hope you just enjoy this video and sh share it with your friends if he has the same problem maybe or just subscribe to my channel and see more videos like this one if you are enjoying the computer field and the technology field i see you in the next video